Hello, kids, and today we're gonna learn about numbers and the colors. And also, we're gonna solve the elephant puzzle. Okay, let's start. Oh, what we've done, we've made a mess, and right now we need to find the blue elephant and the numbers. Okay, let's start. So first of all, let's clean up our puzzle board, okay? So let's start with the numbers. So this is number one. So we need to find the number one. Can you say the number one? Yes, here it is. Number one. Great. And we need one wheel here. So let's try to find it. Okay, here it is. One wheel. Let's put it. Great. And number one is red color. And the wheel is also red color. Great. Let's continue with the number two. So we need to find it. Can you see the number two? Yes, here it is. It's number two. And it's also red color. Okay, let's place it on our board like this. Okay, and then let's try to find two red wheels. Here they are. Great, let's take them and let's put one and two. So we have two number, number two, and it is red color. So one and two. Great. So the next number that we need to find is number three. Can you see the number three? Yes, here it is, the number three. Let's take the number three and put it on a board. Here. Okay, so one, two, and three. And we need to find three wheels. And it is yellow color. Okay, so let's grab them. And one, two, and three. Great. And the number three is yellow color. And the wheels are also yellow color. Okay, let's continue. So the next number that we need to find is number four. And can you see the number four? Yes, here it is. Number four. Okay. And it is green color. Number four. And where we should place the number four? Can you see the shape? Here is the number four. So let's count one, two, three, and four. Great. And then let's take the wheels. So we have four wheels. One, two, three, and the last one, four. Great. Well done. And the next one that we're gonna pick, gonna be the number five. Can you see the number five? Here is the number five, correct, well done. And number five is blue color. Okay, so let's place it on a board here. Well done. And let's count one, two, three, four, and five. And right now we need to find five wheels. Okay, let's try to find them. We need to find blue wheels so here is one two three four and five let's take them and let's place it on the board a one then two then three four and the last one five great okay and the next one number that we have is number six and can you see the number six so if we're gonna look at this one, this is number six. Great, let's take the number six and let's place it right after the number five. Right here, great. And let's then take the six the pink wheels. So let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Well done. So it's a pink color, number six. Let's continue with the number seven. So can you see the number seven on this board? Here is the number seven, right, great. And the number seven is orange color. So let's place it like this. And then let's take the orange wheels. So we need all the orange wheels. 
And what we're gonna do, we're gonna count together. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Well done. And the next one gonna be the number eight. So let's take the number eight. Here is the number eight. And let's place it on the board. Right after the number seven. Well done. And the number eight is blue color. So we need to find blue wheels. Can you see the blue wheels? So let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So let's put them on the pole next to that number eight. So let's do it together. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and the last one, eight. Well done. So we only left with two numbers. So the next number, you know it. What's the number next one? After the eight, it's number nine. Okay, great. So here we have the number nine. So let's put it right here and it's a pink color number nine so let's take the pink wheels so here we have all the pink wheels right so let's take them and let's count one two three four five six seven eight and the last one nine well done and then the next number that we're gonna take gonna be the last one number 10 so here's the number 10 and here we have the number 10 violet color so let's put it here great and let's take all that violet wheels and put them on the pole okay so let's count together one two Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Well done, we've completed the numbers board, so we can continue with solving the puzzle. So we need to find the elephant, and first of all, let's find the let's look at the blue color of the puzzle so here is the blue color so when we try to find the blue color we put it away like this and let's look at the is it the blue color yes so let's put it here then can you see the blue color is this a blue color yes okay is this a blue color this one yes okay great then let's look do we have other any blue colors here is the blue color right but let's turn around again oh there is another blue color and this is the part of the elephant the ear okay here is another one blue color then the elephant nose and then let's turn around again can we see the blue color no okay can we see here blue color Great. Let's turn around again and see if there is a blue color. No. Some blue color. No. Yes, here is the ear of the elephant. Okay, so at the moment, we found enough of the pieces to, to connect them together and try to solve the elephant puzzle. So let's start with the face. So the face consists of ears and noses. So here is the ear. And here is another ear so here's the part of the eye also right so then we have a nose of the elephant like this right and here we have a lax so let's think is it goes well no so let's maybe try this one yes and then put this after after the lax next one right so it almost kind of starting to see the full picture here but we still need some uh, puzzles to find. So maybe let's try to place this one here, right? 
And then another one gonna be the tail of the elephant here. Okay. So like this. So right now we found the puzzles that we could connect and we need to find new ones. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna try to turn around and see if there is a image of the elephant or maybe some kind of like a hint, right? Then let's turn around this one. Can we see? Okay, here is the blue color and the cloud and the elephant, right? So let's place it here. Let's turn around this. Oh, here is the leg of the elephant, right? So we right away can place it down here, right? So let's turn around another one and see. Can you see maybe elephant, maybe part of the elephant? No. Okay, let's, let's place it away. So there is another. Part. Oh, I can see here the part of the elephant, and I think it's the body of the elephant. Let's put it here. So let's then take the next one. So turn around. Can we see the part of the elephant? Yes, here is the ear of the elephant, and here is a tree. So maybe we can turn around like this and place right here. Great. We still need to find some pieces, but we almost done. Great job. So I can I think this is the head of the elephant and and we can place it here. Connect with this one. Great. Let's turn around again. This one and see do we. Okay, here's the flower sprite. And here we can see on the puzzle piece here is also the flowers, right? So what we can do, we can try to place right now this pieces together. You see? Great. So the next one we have is the mountain right and here we have a tree so uh let's try to find a tree so maybe it's this one no it doesn't go here well it's not that tree that we need so maybe uh, let's try this one because here is the small part of the elephant also yes great job and then let's take the ear here's the ear of the elephant Yes, so we only need to turn around this puzzle piece to try to solve it. Okay, here it is, right like this. Great! So we solved the elephant puzzle, and it was not that easy, but we accomplished it. Great, well done, and we also learned about the numbers. So we learned about number one, number two, number three, Number four, number five, number six, number seven, number eight, number nine, and number ten. Great. Well done. See you in the next video. Look what we have today, guys. We have shapes. We have circle, rectangle, triangle, square, and pectagon because it has five holes one two three four five we have a puzzle of made of cubes with a rabbit or a bunny with his carrot and we have fishes we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten fishes Oh no, look, everything has disappeared. What we gonna do? The shapes are gone, the puzzle is gone, and the fishes are gone. Let's try to find them, and I think they will be in these boxes. Look! Yes, they are definitely in there. Let's see what colors we have. We have yellow, we have pink, we have red, we have orange, we have green, and we have blue. Which one do we want to open first? Okay, let's start with the orange. I feel like there is a lot. Ready, steady, dive. Ooh. Let's see what we have. We have three shapes, two cubes, and two fishes. Let's see where we can pull our circle. Oh, it has one hole and it goes here. 
Let's see where we can put our triangle. No. No. Yes, three holes. Look, one, two, three. And let's see where we can put our pectagon. Maybe here. Maybe here. Maybe here. Yes, well done. Now let's see, we have T cubes. And we should be able from these cubes to make a rabbit. Okay, let's leave it. It's here for now. We have, we need to find another two or three cubes to be able to complete a puzzle. Okay? So for now, let's leave it here. And two fishes. Will we to put it in order? We have number one. It's definitely will, go, will be first. And we have number three. So it definitely will be somewhere here between number three and number four. Let's open another box. Let's open the pink one. Ooh, sounds like there is a lot. Whoa! We have another cube, three shapes, and one fish. Let's start with shape. We have a rectangle. Let's see where we can put it. Maybe here. Maybe here. No, it has tea holes. And indefinitely we go here. Yay. Well then. Next, we have our square. Let's see where we can put our square. Maybe here. No. Maybe here. No. Uh, maybe here. Yay. Well done. And we have a triangle. Where we should go? Here. No. Here. No. Oh, look, there is another triangle. And it goes on top of it. Yay! Well done. Then we have another peep. But we need, I think, another... Another cube to be able to complete it by the... So we're gonna leave it here for now. We have three cubes. Let's see where we can put our fish. We have number seven. Wow. It will definitely go somewhere here between number eight and number nine. Let's open another box. What color do you want to open? Let's open the green one. Ready? Ready? Go! Whoa! We have another tea keeps. We have three, sh four shapes. One, two, three, four. And three fishes. Okay, let's start with shape. We have a rectangle. Where should they belong? In, maybe here. No. Maybe here. No. Oh, look. Tea holes. And it goes here. Perfectly. Now let's see where we can put our circle. Kingdom, maybe here. No. And maybe here. No. Wow, look. Yay. Well done. Now we have a square a pectagon. Where we should put a pectagon? Hmm. Maybe here. Maybe here. No, no. Maybe here. Yes. Well done. And the square will go here. Well done. Now let's see what we have with our fishes. We have number 10. And it definitely will be the last number, so I'm gonna put it here. And we have number six. Number six goes before a seven, but after five. So we're gonna put it before number seven, and we will need to put number five somewhere here. And look, we have another of two cubes. And I think we can see if we can make something from the rabbit. Okay. I think this one will go... It will be the first scoop of the top row. This will be in the middle, his body. 
We have his ears. Nai. Oh. Nai. Look. I think this will go here, because it's the cloud and the blue thing. It's matching. And the carrot. I think the carrot will be somewhere here. Oh no, look, it's here. We nearly completed it. And the ear, I think it will be the second ear. It will be somewhere here, maybe. Okay, let's open the another box and find out if we have another keeps. Let's open the yellow one. Ready? Ready? Go! Whoa! We have another three shapes and only one keep. What? Oh, look, it's the fades. I think I know where it should be. Let's put it here. Yes, well done. And this one? Hmm, I don't feel like it will be here, but let's leave it for now. Okay. Let's see what we can do with our shapes. We have another rectangle. And where should we put it? Maybe here? No. Maybe here? Not. Oh no, look. Two yellow rectangles and the third one will go here. Well done. Let's see where we can put our triangle. Can you help me guys? Maybe here? Maybe here? Oh no, it will go here. Look, another triangle. And let's see where we can put our square. Where is it going? Maybe here? No, maybe here? No, oh, here? Yay! Well done. And let's see what fish we have. We have number G. And number G goes after one, but before number three. Look, and we have number one and number three. And the number two goes in the middle of those numbers. Well, Dad, we nearly completed everything. Let's open the blue box now. Oh, another cube. And one, two, three, four, four shapes and two fishes. Let's start with shape. We have a circle. Where do you think we should put it? Maybe here? No, I, uh, look, definitely it go here. Yes. Let's see where we can put our square. Maybe here? Maybe here? No. Uh, look, yes. Well done. Let's see where we can put our rectangle. Maybe here? Nah, looks like there is a lot. Maybe here? Not. Oh, look, yellow and yellow. It will go here. Yes. Well done. And let's see where we can put our pectagon. It's one. There is three. There is three. There is four. But there is five. And there is five holes. Let's put it here. Yay. Well done. Let's see, we have another cube. Let's see what we have here. Look, another ears. I think this one will go here. And then this, this it part of ear will definitely go here. Oh, yay, well done. And we have three fishes. We have fish number five. And fish number nine. The fish number nine goes before number ten. And we have number ten. So we're gonna put the fish number nine here. But fish number five goes before six and after four. And we have number six. So we're gonna put number five here. And we have our last box. Let's see what we have here. Ooh. Whoa, we have two keeps, 
three shapes and two fishes. Let's start with the shapes. We have a circle. Okay, guys, the last circle. We, by now, we should know where to put it. Maybe here? No. Maybe here? No. Definitely, it will go here. Well done. Now we have our triangle. Where we should put it? Maybe here? No. Maybe here? No. Yes, it will go here. Well done. And the last is our pectagon. Okay. On the first try, we should put it... Well done. Exactly. Here. Yay! We have completed our shapes. Let's move on. Onto our cubes. Let's find the two last pieces that we're missing. On the rabbit. Oh, look, I see some carrot. And I think the carrot, if the carrot is here, then the carrot he will, here will be as well. Oh, look! Oh, yes! And the last one. Guys! But wait, oh, another carrot and the tail. Look! This one will go here. Yay! We have completed the rabbit. Well done. And now we have only two fishes left. We have fish number four and fish number eight. The fish number four goes before five, but after three. And we have number three and number five. So on the fish four goes it between those numbers. And we have the last fish, number eight. Number eight goes before number nine, but after a number seven. So we're gonna put it here, because we have number seven and number nine, and we're gonna put it here in the middle. Well done. Look, we have completed all the fishes, all the puzzles, and all the shapes. Again, we have an orange circle, a yellow rectangle, a green triangle, a blue square, and a red pectagon. Then we have a rabbit, which was 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, of consisted of 9 keeps. Well done, guys. And we have completed all 10 fishes. Look. We have fish number one, number three, number three, number four, number five, number six, number seven, number eight, number nine, and number ten. Well done, guys. See you soon. Bye-bye. And today we're going to learn about the numbers, about the colors. We're also going to solve our puzzle with the police officer, the dog. And we also gotta find the puzzle pieces for the plane. And you can already see that one puzzle piece just went off. But that's okay. Let's start and we have beautiful crayons. So let's start. Oh, where did the numbers go? And the puzzles and the airplane. Mm, let's think. And you can see we have a lot of crayons. Huh, maybe let's open our first crayon. And the first crayon that we're gonna open gonna be the green crayon. So let's do it. Let's shake it. Let's open it. Wow, look how many things we have. We have the numbers, that puzzle piece, and the puzzle piece from the airplane. And we also have another number. So let's start with a puzzle piece. And let's take this puzzle piece and look at this puzzle board where we can place this part of the car and it's a back part of the car let's think I think we should place it like this great let's look at those numbers and we have number 10 and numbers 1 okay let's think where we can place the number 10 and let's count 1 2 3 Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and yes, ten. And it's a ten green color. Great, and we have number one yellow color. So let's think what we can place. Hmm. 
I think it should go here because it starts with one. One, two, three, four. Great! We found two numbers. And we also have the part of the air airplane. And I think it's a wing. Let's look at this image. Mm. And where we can place. Let's again look at the shape. And I think it could go maybe here. Let's leave it like this. And later we can change. Let's look at those crayons. Hmm, which next one we should open? Let's maybe take the pink one. Great, and let's shake it. Open it. Wow, we have the number, the puzzle piece, and the piece from airplane. Okay, let's start with the number. And here we have the number two. And let's think where we can place it. Let's count one and two. And you can see it's a, also like a flower shape and it's green color. So we're gonna place it here, great. And here we have the body of the airplane and you can see we have windows. Let's think where we can place it. Hmm, I think it should go somewhere here, but you can see our wing doesn't go here well. So maybe let's rearrange and maybe let's turn around like this and take this wing and place it like this wow great it worked wow amazing and let's thank the puzzle piece for the police car and here you can see we have a traffic lights we have a green color the yellow and we also have the part of the police car Let's think where we can place, and I think it should go under the sun, like this. Great! Let's continue with our puzzle adventure. And the next crayon that we're gonna pick, gonna be the yellow crayon. Let's shake. Wow, we have a lot of things here. And let's look at the numbers first. And we have three numbers. We have number three. And let's think where we can put the number three on this board. Let's count one, two, three. Okay, great. And it is red color. Let's look at this number. This is number four. Let's think where we can place on the board. Let's count one, two, three, four. Amazing. And we have the mighty number 12 and let's think and count where we can place one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and twelve great and let's take the puzzle piece and let's turn around and here we have the wheel of the police car and we have two wheels, but where we should place it? Here you can also see we have a part of the checkboard. Okay, let's maybe combine like this. These two puzzles, great! We combine two puzzles, amazing! And let's look at that airplane. And here we have a cabin where the pilot is sitting. And let's try to place it on this board. Boom, Maybe here? Seems to be. It should go here. It should fit here. Great! Let's let it like this. And let's continue with our puzzle journey. And let's pick that orange color. Let's shake it and open it. Wow! We have numbers. And let's go for the numbers. So here we have the number. It is six or it is nine. I think it's number nine and it's yellow color. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Great. And here we have number 11. Red color. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven! Great! And let's take this puzzle and turn around. And here we have the funny police car dog. 
and you can see on the image and you can see the sunglasses of the police car dog so we can place it right here like this and we have also the cloud on the top great we're doing so well and let's take the wing and i think it's a wing of the airplane so let's put it here i think it's gonna fit yes and we have two stars on the wings great let's continue and we almost are finished with our puzzles you're doing amazing let's take the blue crayon and let's shake okay here we only have puzzles and numbers so let's start with a number and here we have blue color number and it's called number eight and let's count one two three four five six seven and yes eight correct and here we have the part of the police car wheel and i think it should go here let's try no i think it's the second wheel yes great and let's look at this one here we have the symbol of the police and it's a shield the yellow shield with a red star so let's think where we can fit it and i think it should go right in the middle let's try together and maybe let's do like this like this let's start from the here and then place it okay we almost got it we just need to take this part place it like this and then yes we combined all of those puzzles great and let's look at those two crayons and we only have two left we have red colored crayon and brown colored crayon which should we open and i think we should open that brown color crayon let's open wow look what we have here and here we have number seven so let's count one two three four five six and seven and you can see it's a red color and it's a shape of the star and let's look at this number it's number five let's count one two three four and five and it's a yellow color shape and let's look at those puzzle pieces and here we have wheel and we have another part of the wheel so if we look at this puzzle board we can see that there is two wheels and we need to connect them like this great and we have also another puzzle piece and you see it's a windows of the house where the people live okay let's try to place here we have a sun and a traffic light and here we have the windows where the people live so let's place like this great and here we have a propeller of the airplane and let's see and it's really small compared to the tail so i think it should go front like this great and we left with our last crayon and it's a red color great let's shake it and open it wow we have the puzzle piece the number and the airplane puzzle piece okay let's start with the number and it's a hard shape you can see it looks like a heart and it's a number six and it's a green color so let's start one two three four five six great and let's look at this puzzle piece and here we have the sun and let's look where we can place it we have the sun and the traffic light and i think you should go here because it's the last place where we can fit it like this great and we have the tail of the airplane and it's an orange color and if here is the last place where we can fit it let's do it yes great we've completed all our puzzles we've completed the clock puzzle we've completed the airplane puzzle we've completed the police dog puzzle but let's go back to the clock puzzle and let's learn about the clock 
So we have here the 12 o'clock. Here we have one o'clock. Here we have two o'clock. And this is called three o'clock. And this one is called four o'clock. And this one is called five o'clock. And this one is called six o'clock. And this one, Jess, it's seven o'clock. You're right, Ray. And this one is called eight o'clock. And this one, remember, yes, it's nine numbers, so it's called nine o'clock. Let's turn around again. And this one is called, yes, ten o'clock. And this one, yes, it's our eleven number, so it's called eleven o'clock. And the last one is twelve o'clock. Gray. And we have here the yellow color. Here we have green color, here we have red color, here we have blue color, and this one, you know it, yes, it's a yellow color. This one is green color, correct, and this one, what is this color? It's a red color. Let's look at the eight, and this one is blue color. And number nine, what color it is? It's the same color as the five. Yes, it's yellow color. And let's look at the 10. Which color it is? Let's look at the 2 and 6. It's the same color. It's green color. And this one, 11. Let's loop. Okay, is it the same color as 7, 3, 11? It's red color. And the last one is blue color. Great, and you can see that Minnie and Mingy Mouse are pretty happy with the word that we've done. Great, amazing. And I'm gonna see you in the next video. Thank you, kids. Bye. See you next time. Don't forget to subscribe.